ahead and I'm coming at you with my shave of the day for today. It is October 12th, 2018. Okay, so I did want to say uh, thanks for joining me for the shave. Definitely do appreciate it. Hope everybody's doing well. I'm not doing too bad myself here. It's a Friday night. Uh, I'm just going to be home here. I'm not going to be, <laughs> no plans for going out or anything. But I just definitely wanted to get my uh, head shaved and uh, a little bit of my neck here, cheeks, just so I'm good to go for tomorrow. Okay, so to get started with the shave here, I did want to go through some of the equipment we'll be using. Uh, couple new uh, a new product and one I haven't used in a while here so just uh, hardware side the razor I'm gonna be using it's the Yaki DLC razor see it's got this uh, I like this handle it's cool it looks like the an old like a wolfman handle it's pretty cool and the uh, that's what it looks like here kind of an Edwin Jagger style head I think this is a, a decent aggression it's not too great it's not too much but not too little uh, the blade I have in here is a Gillette Thin. First, uh, second time I use this here. So we'll see how it goes. First use of it uh, last time. I thought it worked out pretty well. <clears throat> the brush I'm going to be using is the Yaki Purple Haze brush. With this, I call it a Mew Knot. It's like a brown and going into a white. Very soft here. Backbone's not too bad either. So it's a nice little brush. I do like this. It's a cool, I like that cool swirl through the handle. <clears throat> okay, then the software side. Uh, the soap we're going to be using... Uh, since today was, it's definitely been the coolest it's been. So pretty much fall has started now here in northeastern Pennsylvania. So I'm going to go with uh, Huawei Shaving Co. Doc Holiday. This is a uh, sense of mold apple cider. And uh, such a great scent. It smells amazing. That's what it looks like there. I can, uh, I can put my finger into it. Somewhat soft. It got a little harder, I think. But, uh, yep, Doc Holiday. looking forward to using that. An aftershave. I'm going to use a sample of uh, Willow the Wisp. Was it? Yeah. Yeah, Willow the Wisp from PAA when I got my uh, Atomic, Pumpk Atomic Pumpkin. They sent me this. And this used to be uh, formerly called Clown Fruit. Uh, but with that, Local Gent, uh, I think, collaborated with PAA with that. And local gent is uh, now going. I'm not sure if they're out of business or they're, or if they're out yet. But uh, yeah, so I'd imagine they just went with this then, so they can still offer it. Uh, I'm interested to see what this smells like. I've never smelled it. I'm gonna open it right now here and just. Uh, this is star jelly too. This is the first time using a star jelly. It's supposed to be pretty good. star jelly uh, smells pretty good there get a better scent maybe when I go to put it on so I'll just put this aside for now here okay and that's what we'll be using uh that's supposed to be like a balm slash aftershave so we'll see how that goes okay so uh, that's some of the hardware and the software we'll be using so we can go ahead and get the shave started so let's go ahead and rock this head shave out so what I'll do just take the lid off of this Run the brush under some water here. We can start uh, getting this going. Okay, so I'll bring this to the a little more uh, water here, I think. been a while since I used this one here. I actually saw uh, Russell just po put up a post. The uh, owner of Wild West Shaving Co. He just celebrated his first year in business. So that's pretty great. This is actually, I think I was one of his first uh, customers. And this was the first, one of the first soaps I got. So let's try that. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Lost the hair. <laughs> Lost a couple. I wasn't really mashing on them. Okay, so just let me... A little water there. Bring this to the head. Start building up the lather. The soap is brown. So you can kind of see it has a brown tinge to it right now. I 
like to see it brown just a little bit. Yeah, this is a really nice scented soap, especially for this time of year. Just that mold apple cider. Smells great. But yeah, unfortunately, it's been a while since I've used uh, this here. I don't know, you know, just sometimes you have your soaps, you try to cycle through them a little bit. And... Just hasn't got any use recently. But here we are now. Add a little more water to this, I think. Seems to boot up in a nice uh, lather here. That's what I'm seeing. I just getting the head shaved done tonight because I have to work on the weekends now. Here I'm covering for my sister. Still hasn't had a baby yet. But any day here. So I just figured to get that ready. That way I don't have to get up any earlier in the morning. <clears throat> okay, so I'll go with that. First pass here with the grain with this uh, Gillette Thin Blade, the Aki DLC Razor. Yeah, it's feeling good. Yeah, I do like this, uh, this razor. I think it's a pretty good aggression here. <clears throat> and this one is like a chromed out version. I think this one in particular you can get in many different colors on the Aki site. This was very kindly sent to me by Yaki to uh, feature on the channel. <clears throat> I had uh, bought a couple brushes from them a while back, but uh, this is one of the newer razors or newer products I got from them. The couple brushes I bought myself, the actually this brush that I use today. And this razor were given to me. So uh, thank you, Yaki, again. And I gotta say, their, uh, their product's pretty good here. I got no complaints with these razors. The You know, I'm sure they, uh, they're not made with the premium materials or anything, but They work pretty well for me here. Kind of in the budget category, but that's fine. I tend to wet shave on a budget, too. Or I try to. Haven't been buying much recently. I spent a good amount here not too long ago, like 100 bucks. So, I probably won't be... <clears throat> buying anything till like maybe around the holidays Christmas get myself something or something like that you know how it goes Yeah, this blade seems to be working out okay. Feels like uh, I got a bit of growth here, like almost a week or something like that. So it may, you know, it's a little tougher, but it seems to be getting through it. 
I might get one or two more shaves out of this blade. Okay, that seems to be okay. The first pass there, and then we'll go back for pass number two. I'm just gonna put a little more water on the brush. Bring this to the head, fill up the lather again. Slick feels real good. The lather just whips right up here. No problems. <clears throat> this uh, is the older formulation, of course, on the uh, Wawa Shave and Co. soap. They did put, uh, they did change the formulation up since they started, but still pretty good in my opinion. Uh, second pass here with the grain or against the grain. Yep, very good here. Not feeling too bad at all. Forever how old this blade is, it's doing a good job. Not sure when the Gillette Thins came out, but it's something to maybe take a look at and find out if I can find that. So I got quite a few of them actually. My brother picked them up for me. <clears throat> he was in New York on vacation over the summer. Pretty cool. My buddy just messaged me on, left a comment uh, on Instagram. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, please do. I'm at Sledhead Shaves now. I just changed my handle. It was Bill Sled, but I just changed it to Sledhead Shaves. Oops. I don't really post anything personal on there, so just figured just keep it a shaving Instagram for now. Just doing like one of these like cross the grain actions. Good. <clears throat> Feeling pretty good. Still pretty smooth, I think. Kind of disappointed. There is a uh, Oktoberfest going on tomorrow from like noon to five. Of course, I'm going to miss it because now I'm working the weekends here at my uh, my aunt and uncle's real estate office. So I work nine to five. So unfortunately, I'm going to miss it this year. I've gone the past couple, but uh, hey, it is what it is, you know. I'd rather make the money and have the money. <clears throat> and it's 25 to get in, and then you can buy food there too. But hey, you know, that's how it goes. Last year we went late, and it turned out to be the better thing. Because at the end, nobody freaking cared what you did. We were just taking, like, usually just, like, sampling stuff. We were, like, drinking full cans. Because <laughs> nobody was paying attention. We were just taking stuff. We were trying to get rid of it. It's like, oh, man, we, were, we got our money's worth last year.
Good. Okay, I'm going to go back up here for a touch up. Add a little bit more water here just to get her wet a little bit. That's good. Just for touch ups here. Get my hand wet and just feel around a little bit. Pretty dang close, I gotta say. Let me just, I think I have a couple spots. Yeah, like right back here. Pretty dang close, though. I got a little more water in the hand. I think that's good. <clears throat> nice close shave there. I did like that. Clean off the old head here. Just check out the uh, ears here just to make sure everything's. Sorry about that. Get behind the ears. Looking, I think we got that. Okay, so now we're just gonna take care of the neck here a little bit. I might even dip back into the puck. A little splash of water. Whatever. <laughs> Good enough. I could just probably do one of these. Try to get my cheeks first, I guess. Oh boy, this blade's rough on the face. Not so much on the face now. Brutal. 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 <laughs> wow. Can like barely even shave. Oh my god, it hurts. Good enough. Oh my god, that just hurt. Let's try down here. Hopefully, it's not too bad. Okay, that's just the with the grain right there. Ooh, it's a tough one. The blade doesn't like it. That's good.
check out the neck to make sure it's trimmed okay. Yep, looks to be okay. Yeah, I'll call that good. <clears throat> okay. So that turned out pretty well here. I think that blade shot though. Okay. <clears throat> so now we can uh, go ahead and apply some of this uh, Will o' the Wisp Star Jelly here. I don't know how much to use. There's that much. There's still some in here, so we'll see how it goes. Oh, that smells really good. That's a t yeah, I don't know. It's a tough scent to put a... Sweet kind of scent. It's nice though. I like that. Very nice. Uh, I do like that star jelly. I wouldn't mind picking some of that, some of that up here. Okay, so that does take care of the uh, shave of the day here. So I'm just going to go through again what we use for the shave. So the razor, Yaki DLC razor uh, with the Gillette thin blade. I think that uh, blade's done here, but uh, did a good job. Oh boy, I almost cut myself. Uh, brush. Yaki Purple Haze Brush. I uh, like that thing. Real nice. The soap. Wild West Shaving Company. Doc Holiday. That's mold apple cider. It smells really good. And the post shave. This is the uh, sample here. Well of the West from PAA. Phoenix Artists and Accoutrements. So... Uh, real nice stuff. I like that scent a lot. I might pick some up. I think it's pretty cool too. They, the packages, I think the soap, and they have a pre shake cube. It glows in the dark. Pretty cool. Okay, so I did want to say uh, thanks for checking out the video. Definitely do appreciate it. Uh, please like and comment below. I like, you know, seeing both, but if you can't leave a comment, at least leave a thumbs up on the way out. And also don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You can do that below. Uh, definitely appreciate uh, subscriptions here. So again, uh, thanks for checking out the video. Hope you have a great night. Hope you have some great shaves.